in today's power tip, we're going to learn how to compress images in PowerPoint 2013, which is part of Office 365. In PowerPoint 2013, you can compress just a single image or several images, and you have several options of what resolution you'd like them to be. Picture the scene. You've got to create this wonderful PowerPoint presentation full of lovely photographs, maybe of your holiday, maybe of a building your company's building. It could be of new premises you're moving to. Imagine any scenario where you have lots of photographs. Those photographs, especially if they're taken with a high resolution camera, will be quite large in their size and they're going to make your presentation absolutely huge. Not only that, if you wanted to pop those pictures onto a website, they would be rather large for the website as well and cause your pages to load slowly. The solution is to compress those images and there's a handy tool in PowerPoint 2013 that allows you to do just that. Here are a couple of images that I want to use in a presentation that I'm creating. It's a presentation about a show that I spoke at last year. I spoke at the office show last October. So here are two pictures and this one having been selected, if you look over to the right, you'll see that the properties here tell me that it's 3.59 megabytes. And if I switch to the other picture, I don't really want to open it, but I just want to see its properties tell me it's four megabytes in size. So you'll agree that those are both quite large images. And now here I am back in PowerPoint and I've added this image to a slide. And here's the other image as well. So all nicely set out there, ready for me to go. But if I save this, which I already have, and if I show you back on the desktop where it was saved, here is the presentation. If I right click and choose properties, you'll see that the size of those images, the size of the whole presentation and with just two images is 742 kilobytes. Now that's not so much, but if I keep adding more and more pictures to it, it's going to get very big indeed. So what I can do is I can compress either one or all of the images. So I'll start by selecting the image and in another video I can show you how I created that nice effect around it. But for today, we're going to focus on compressing. And on the format ribbon, you'll see this icon which says compress pictures. And it compresses pictures in the document to reduce size. So I'll click it and I'm just going to apply it to this one picture for the moment. You can choose which resolution, print, which will give you the best presentation resolution. And that's good if you're going to be printing a brochure, perhaps, from this presentation. You can go for the screen, which is 150 points per inch, good for web pages and projectors. Or you can go to email. So if you're going to pop it into a document that's a Word document or share it by email, you can make it smaller still. I'm just going to go for the middle one for now and I'm going to click OK. And at this point, I'm just going to save my presentation. And if I come back to the desktop and go back to my properties, you'll see that it's gone down to 516 kilobytes. And if I come back into PowerPoint, I come to the second picture, select it on the format, go back to compress. And if I Again, I've only got the one picture to apply it to. Choose the same resolution, click OK, save the presentation so that it creates that size. Come back to my desktop and look at the properties. It's gone down to 308 kilobytes. So I'm sure you'll agree that's a great little tool for making sure that your presentations are smaller in size and easy to share with other people. Whether you're saving them on OneDrive or SharePoint and sharing them that way, or whether you're emailing them to one another in your presentation. So if you want your staff to be proficient like this with Microsoft PowerPoint and learn more than just compressing images, do get in touch with me, Shelley Fischel, at theittrainingsurgery.com. Give us a call. What are you waiting for?